Okay, there are boys beating the crap out of another boy. They're chasing this boy. There's no teacher to be found. No teacher to be found at all, anywhere on the playground. And this boy keeps getting his butt kicked all over soccer. Okay, this is Friday, September 7th, 2012, 12.10, which is lunchtime. This is one of the first Friday schools. They don't usually have Friday schools. It's usually Monday through Thursday. And again, there's kids putting hands all over each other. And again, physical contact being done. And again, whether they're playing or not, this has been a problem for three years. No supervision anywhere. Do you see a teacher anywhere? Okay, there's no supervision whatsoever. And in fact, it's lunchtime, so they don't need to supervise. But yet there's these kids out there beating little kids. No teacher whatsoever. No staff member paying attention. Nothing. Nothing. Let's see if these little boys decide to fight again. Again, no supervision, none whatsoever. See, they kicked him really, really hard. He's been on the ground now for 30 seconds. He's in tears. He's in pain. Nobody. Okay, he got back up. That's good. So his tears might not have been real, so that's good, but still.
Plus, if you see over there by the basketball hoop, probably can't see very clearly, but again, there's no teacher's staff. None. No teacher staff on the playground at all. See, look, they're tackling this kid. They're tackling this little kid. Look, look. Tackling this little kid, throwing balls on his head, hurting him. Oh, there's a teacher standing by the door over there, but she's not doing anything about these kids tackling him. So the problem is, the problem is that right now, my kids are not at the school, and right now, this would not be such a big deal to me, but there's a girl, she just threw a boy on the ground. No big deal. Nobody's caring. He's hurt, but, oh, maybe not. Maybe he's just playing. But here's my thing. Right now, my kids are not enrolled in this school. I took them out a year and a half ago. Um, in 2011. And here's the thing. The bullying, the supervision, it's still there. And yet, I have been accused, the principal of this school, or superintendent as you will, told DHS that I took my kids out of school because of my daughter having incontinence. And I just want to point out that the reasons that we took our kids out of this school and homeschooled them is because of the bullying and the no supervision and the lack of and just the, the just pure disrespect of taking care of people's kids. I mean, the kid just fell on the ground and another kid just kicked him. I hope you guys saw that. No teacher, none. They've got a fifth grader or a sixth grader. She might be seventh grader over there, trying to boss them around. And look, the kid in the white shirt is again tackling the little boy. Look at that! That boy goes up behind the other boy, grabs him by the neck, and throws him down. And that's supposed to be okay. And this is supposed to be okay. Again, the staff member that was out there for just a minute, she's gone. Kid on the ground. Okay, I get boys will be rough. I get that. But this is absolutely ridiculous. Somebody's not only going to get hurt, but possibly get... Oh my gosh, they are tackling this poor kid. Tackling him. The girl that was telling him what to do got bored and went over and sat down. Apparently she's tired of dealing with the boy's attitude. <laughs> 